Hi, it's me, Bridget Leroy again, and um, I had the most incredible thing happen to me. Um, I have a friend on Facebook. She actually um, Facebook private messaged me yesterday asking me if I knew any um, like high school students or anyone who would be willing to come and help her garden, and I offered myself to come and help her garden. Um, so we're actually going to meet today. Okay, bye. Hey, good morning. It's around uh, 7.30. On Monday morning, I met with uh, Barbara yesterday. She's wonderful, and um, and I have the job, so I'm going to be weeding today. Um, she showed me around her garden. She's a, a lovely person, and I'm really looking forward to kind of learning about gardening. Plus, she's also we're going to do a little barter, and she's going to give me some of her really super cool plants. So I'm very excited about that. So I, I've been here for a little while, and I've compiled a large bunch of weeds that I um, I managed to get from back there and uh, I'm gonna keep working. Barbara and I are gonna do a little barter as well and she has some beautiful thing over here called, uh, you guys all probably all know about this, hens and chickens. And I'm totally addicted to chickens. So she's gonna give me some of this. It's a ground cover, it's a succulent, which is so cool to have up north. And, um, and it spreads and it's just like, it does these beautiful flowers, like cactus flowers. So I'm psyched. Okay, here I go. Oh, friends of mine scared me on Facebook last night. Talk of snakes and spider bites. But, um, you know, the only, oh, Buster Shush. The only bugs that really scare me are useless bugs, like, um, uh, cockroaches and stuff like that. But I don't, I guess they're food for somebody. I wonder what they taste like. I bet they taste like chicken. Anyway, so I just, uh, you know, I'm scared of, like, getting into, like, a pile of leaves like this and just having a whole bunch of really scary things jump out at me and, like, <laughs> try to bite me. But um, this is just so peaceful. And uh, it's hard to film and weed at the same time, so I won't be doing much of that. Look, how are things in Glockamora? It's very Irish. You know what's really amazing is that um, what I really am finding I like about this sorry to wax philosophical for a minute, but is that um, it's like tweezing your eyebrows or like, you know, tweezing your chin hairs or whatever it is that we tweeze because it's like, you, you know, you do one pass and then you look again and there's like hairs you didn't notice before. And that's what it's like weeding. Like I'm finding that I'm discovering like as I move the stuff around, I'm like, oh, wait, look, see, look, there's a tiny, tiny little weed. Gotcha, gotcha, see? Oh, look, and this is grass. I hadn't even noticed that one. Gotcha. Okay, that's what I like doing. The main problem over here seems to be clover. See, there's some right there. See all the, the wee shamrocks. Aye, it is a sad day for Ireland when the wee shamrock grows no more. But um, well, maybe I'll find a four-leaf one. That'd be wicked cool. I hope I do. But anyway, in the meantime, I'm just going to grab these little bastards. They come out really easily, except for the really, really big ones with like, um, like these ones with the flowers. Holy cow, look how long this weed is. Anyway, I'm trying to get most of them out from the root, of course, because I'm not an idiot and we don't want them to grow back. But it is hard. There's some roots right there. Yay! Shamrock roots to bring back to the old country. I totally feel like I'm at war with the Irish. Like, I will get you out of... Great Britain. Arr. I just don't know how really um, crazy she wants me to get. How OCD with the bloody shamrocks. <sighs> okay, I think I did a pretty good job here. Uh, kind of getting rid of all those shamrocks and grass. And there's always more to do, but I don't want to get too OCD. But things I need to bring for sure is I need to bring. Um, a towel because I was schwitzing like crazy. Definitely need something to wipe my face with. Some kind of protein because I get a little dizzy. Seriously, this is not for sissies. This is like, I've been working for um, like an hour and a half and I have literally gotten more exercise than I've gotten in 20 years. And when I say that, I don't mean that I exercised this much 20 years ago. I mean that if you took every step, every knee bend, every skip that I have done in the last 20 years and put them all together, that would equal about as much as I've done in the last hour and a half. I think I did quite a lot, but you know, it's, uh, it's, it's hard to tell because there's a lot more to do, but I'm really enjoying it. I have to bring a sweeper thing to, to kind of clean up because you know, dirt goes all over the place and I need to bring a towel and I need to bring a bucket. That's what I need for tomorrow. So 
stay tuned.